My name is Markus Brinkmann, and I'm originally from Krefeld, which is in Germany. Today, we live in a chemical world, and chemicals are really present 24-7 uh, in all that we do in our lives. Uh, from the shampoo when we take a shower, to plant protection products that are used to grow our food, uh, to plastics that surround us everywhere we go in our uh, modern society. So um, many of those chemicals ultimately make it also into water bodies. Uh, and my goal is really to try and uh, make sure that those chemicals don't negatively infect uh, aquatic life uh, in those ecosystems and ultimately also our health. My team and I, we really like to work directly with uh, all stakeholders involved, and that uh, starts from uh, folks in academia uh, to government, NGOs, uh, impacted communities, and also the industry directly. Uh, so, for example, we work with the city of Saskatoon, uh, the province of Saskatchewan, and also indigenous communities uh, trying to tackle their environmental problems and concerns. Um, but we also work directly with the industry. Um, so really try and help them uh, improve their processes and hopefully uh, help them become a little bit greener in what they do. I grew up in Germany in a very heavily industrialized part of the country. Um, so environmental degradation was everywhere and I've been, I witnessed it firsthand. Um, so some common childhood memories would include um, the smelters being fired up on the horizon when uh, the dusk was setting in, or my mother um, showing up on the balcony and yelling down that we all have to come in as kids uh, because there is a cloud of toxic carbon monoxide blowing in uh, from the nearby chemical plants. So um, those experiences really have primed me and motivated me to uh, try and become part of the solution to environmental problems. My favorite course to teach in SENSE is ENVS 805, that's uh, Data Driven Solutions for Sustainability. Um, so a lot of environmental issues are highly complex and solutions to them are not always straightforward or simple uh, by any means. So this course really helps students to appreciate complexity uh, and to embrace it actually. Uh, and it also teaches them some critical skills um, that they will need to make informed and also equitable decisions uh, based on the best available data. My uh, favorite place in nature is anywhere near or on the water. Um, so that could be canoeing or fishing or just dipping my feet. Um, I, I can't really explain it, but for some reason, water has this calming effect on myself uh, that really gives me a sense of peace and, and freedom as well. <laughs> 